Shocker Skrillex out of Reading Festival. Hold on to your glow sticks, music lovers. Reading Festival, the UK's iconic celebration of music and mayhem just threw a curveball. Skrillex, the dubstep demigod himself, was suddenly removed from the lineup. Fans were left speechless. What happened? Why the sudden change? The internet naturally exploded. Forums buzzed. Social media went into overdrive. Everyone was talking about it. Reading Festival, known for its legendary acts and unpredictable moments, had outdone itself. Festival frenzy. What happened? Let's rewind. Reading and Leeds Festival, the twin titans of the UK festival scene, annually unleash a sonic storm. This year was no different. The lineup promised an eclectic mix of genres and generations, with Skrillex standing out as a headliner. Then the unthinkable happened. Skrillex's name, once prominently displayed on the festival's website and app, vanished. Poof! Gone. No explanation, no warning. Just an empty space where the dubstep king once reigned. The disappearing act Skrillex vanishes from the schedule. Imagine this, you're pumped for reading. You've snagged tickets. You've memorized the set times. You're ready to lose yourself in the music. Then you check the app for the hundredth time and BAM! Skrillex is gone. Panic sets in. Is this a joke? A glitch in the matrix? Did someone hit the wrong button? The lack of information only fueled the frenzy. Fans were left in a state of disbelief and digital disarray. Rumour has it speculation runs wild. A vacuum of information, especially in the age of instant updates, is quickly filled by speculation. And speculate, the internet did. Theories ranged from the mundane to the outlandish. Had Skrillex fallen ill? Were there logistical issues? Visa problems? Alien abduction? Okay, maybe not the last one, or maybe. The point is, without any official word, everyone became an armchair detective, piecing together clues from cryptic tweets and blurry Instagram stories. Section 5. Silence from the organisers. The mystery deepens. The silence from Festival Republic, the organisers of Reading and Leeds, was deafening. Hours turned into a day. Still no word. The lack of communication only fueled the fire. Fans, understandably frustrated, took to social media to voice their concerns and demand answers. The festival's social media accounts were bombarded with questions. Direct messages overflowed. The pressure was on. Festival Republic had a full-blown PR situation on their hands. Section 6. A collective sigh of relief. Skrillex is back on. Then just as quickly as he disappeared, Skrillex reappeared. The news spread like wildfire through the festival grounds, igniting a wave of excitement and anticipation. Fans who had been on the verge of despair were now buzzing with renewed energy. Like a glitch in the matrix resolving itself, his name was back on the schedule. It was as if the universe had corrected an error, restoring balance to the festival lineup. The app updates were met with cheers and high fives as festival goers shared the good news with friends and strangers alike. The internet, which had been a breeding ground for conspiracy theories just moments before, erupted in a collective sigh of relief. Social media platforms were flooded with posts and tweets expressing joy and disbelief. Memes and gifs capturing the emotional roller coaster quickly went viral. The roller coaster of emotions was almost too much to handle. From the initial shock of his disappearance to the confusion and speculation that followed, fans had been through a whirlwind of feeling. Now, with Skrillex back on the lineup, the atmosphere was electric. From disappointment to confusion to elation, fans had experienced it all in the span of 24 hours. Conversations buzzed with theories about what had happened, but the prevailing sentiment was one of sheer joy. The festival had been saved and the excitement was palpable. It was a masterclass in how to create buzz, albeit unintentional. The unexpected twist had only heightened the anticipation for Skrillex's performance. As the sun set and the stage lights began to glow, the crowd gathered, ready to witness the return of their favorite DJ. The energy was infectious, and the night promised to be unforgettable. Section 7 Festival Republic speaks the official explanation. Finally, Festival Republic broke their silence. In a brief statement, they explained that Skrillex's temporary removal was due to unforeseen production issues. They apologized for the confusion and assured fans that the show would go on. While the statement lacked specifics, it was enough to calm the storm. 
Fans, relieved that the dubstep deity was back on the menu, readily accepted the explanation. The incident became a cautionary tale about the importance of clear communication in the digital age. Section 8, Reading Festival, A History of Surprises. Reading Festival is no stranger to the unexpected. Over its long and storied history, the festival has seen its fair share of dramatic moments, from surprise guest appearances to last-minute cancellations. Remember when Kurt Cobain made his iconic appearance in a wheelchair? Or when Foo Fighters played a secret set disguised as a Nirvana tribute band? Reading Festival is a place where anything can happen, and often does. Section 9. The Thrill of the Unexpected, Why We Love Live Events. The Skrillex saga, while nerve-wracking for fans, highlights what makes live events so special, the element of surprise. When Skrillex unexpectedly dropped a new track during his set, the crowd went wild. It's these moments of spontaneity that create unforgettable memories. Unlike a pre-recorded playlist, anything can happen at a live show. The energy is palpable the atmosphere electric. You never know when a performer might bring a special guest on stage or when an impromptu jam session might break out. It's this unpredictability that keeps us on the edge of our seats. Each moment is a potential surprise, a chance to witness something extraordinary. The anticipation builds with every beat, every note, every cheer from the crowd. We go to festivals not just for the music, but for the experience, for the shared moments of joy, excitement, and yes, even confusion. It's about the collective euphoria, the sense of community that forms when thousands of people come together for a common passion. It's about being part of something bigger than ourselves, something that unfolds in real time, unscripted and unrehearsed. The magic of live events lies in their ability to bring people together, to create a shared experience that transcends the ordinary. Whether it's a small intimate gig or a massive festival, the connection between the performers and the audience is what makes it truly special. The energy, the excitement, the unpredictability, that's why we love live events. Section 10. The show must go on. Looking forward to Reading Festival. Despite the initial hiccup, the show, as they say, must go on. And what a show Reading Festival promises to be. With or without last-minute lineup changes, the festival is a celebration of music, community and the sheer joy of being present in the moment. So, let's raise our glow sticks, brace ourselves for the unexpected and get ready for another unforgettable reading festival. After all, wouldn't it be boring if everything went exactly according to plan? Section 11. Conclusion. The beat drops. Eventually. In the end, Skrillex's brief disappearance from the Reading Festival lineup was just a blip on the radar, a momentary glitch in the matrix. It was a moment that left festival goers puzzled, staring at their phones, refreshing the app and wondering what had gone wrong. The anticipation built up, the excitement was palpable and then, just like that, it seemed to vanish into thin air. It was a reminder that even in our hyper-connected world, things don't always go as planned. Technology, while a marvel, is not infallible. Sometimes the very tools we rely on to keep us informed and connected can fail us, leaving us in a state of uncertainty. But this uncertainty is also what makes live events so thrilling. The unpredictability, the chance that something unexpected might happen, keeps us on our toes and adds to the overall experience. But it also underscored the enduring appeal of live events, where the unexpected is always part of the equation. The magic of a live performance lies in its spontaneity. The energy of the crowd, the vibe of the music, and the shared experience of being in the moment create memories that last a lifetime. It's these moments of unpredictability that make festivals so special, where every beat, every drop, and every cheer is a testament to the power of music to bring people together. So, next time you're at a festival, phone in hand, frantically refreshing the app for updates, take a deep breath and remember, the beat drops eventually. Embrace the uncertainty, let go of the need for constant updates and immerse yourself in the experience. The music will play, the lights will shine and the crowd will roar and when the beat finally drops, it will be worth the wait. And when it does, it's going to be epic. The uh, anticipation, the build-up and the eventual release create a moment of pure euphoria. It's a reminder that sometimes the best things in life are worth waiting.